Hey everybody, I just got two pieces of information in the last 24 hours regarding Guild of Guardians. I got a lot to unpack in a short amount of time, so if you're ready, come on! Let's go! Mutable X, company that's working on layer 2 solutions to reduce gas fees so we don't have to dish out more money for nothing. They're working with OpenSea now. If you don't know anything about OpenSea, they're like the Amazon of the NFT community. They sell all kinds of stuff from professional athlete images to the sandbox game and a lot others that i could talk about all day huge huge company and the fact that they're taking on immutable x to help them out shows the level of professionalism and the ability that immutable x has why is that important well last medium post from guild of guardians they're talking about the preseason sale coming out with the heroes and everything that they got coming they're using immutable x and i was a little skeptical at how they're going to do this because they're not going to give you possession right away to help us save money on gas fees which is a good thing but i've never seen this done and i was kind of like i don't know how this is going to work and i'm a little skeptical of it well immutable x is going to give it to us at a later date seeing that immutable x is being taken on by open seas gives me that much more confidence that this is going to work out so this is a very very positive sign for gilded guardians i like it awesome job mutable x keep working hard let's move on to the next one here medium post yesterday introducing the eight legendary guild of guardian heroes this is really cool stuff guys there's really not much to explain about this except talk about the heroes so, so let's break it down these will be entirely owned by the play players legendary and here is the first one helia now this one was there was a competition for like a backstory and whoever came up with the coolest backstory got to name her and whoever won it i don't remember the name they named her Helia, so that's the name of Stuck. Princess of Flame, Faction Horde. Woo, okay. Um, boy, that sounds familiar. I hope we're not going to be messing with copyright, guys. Uh, if you know where I'm going with this. Make sure you got your ducks in a row. I don't want you guys to have to take on a behemoth, if you know what I mean. Class ranged, all right. Type fire. Looks like we're going to have some elements in this game for types next one rufus guardian of the skies man cool pick but right away any of you old cats remember uh eagle man look at these low rates that's what i thought of right away sorry i hope my impression was probably terrible faction glade i don't know what that means maybe just a cool name class range type water sticking with the elements there next up cyrus the infernal swordsman right away I love the sword. The sword is just awesome looking. Very, very cool. Looks very, uh, what's the word? Got some mystique about him. A little bit of class, maybe like nobility. Very cool. Empires, the faction. Might be following that nobility theme. Melee for class and fire. Next up, Freya, the Bastion of Defense. Dual wielding shields with red hair and green eyes nice nice definitely probably a tank not a rogue assassin i'm gonna guess faction empire class melee but i'm gonna say this is probably tankish type earth boy that one looks familiar too careful with the copyright stuff guys i don't want to see you guys take on a behemoth of a company you know what i mean i'm not gonna say who it looks like next one leah the priestess of illumination faction glade Last mage. Now this is where we get a little different. Type light. I was thinking we're gonna go with like air. You know, we're doing all the elements, but they switch to light. Next up, well, I'm probably gonna butcher this name. Harkuk. Car, yeah, Karkuk. Karkuk. Ah, Chieftain of the Dreadlands. Very, very cool looking. Boy, this like, this just like sings of. Uh, couple companies but you know there may there might not be a copper and this is like a common theme but again be careful faction horde melee earth high rock the cursed sorcerer now right away i thought of like dr strange but it's not this was pretty far off i'm not worried about copyright issues in this but very cool i like the animation and then you know very mysterious faction glade class mage type dark that makes sense dark and last but not least tavros the arc mage of darkness uh we've seen a leak of this but it wasn't real clear in the picture now it is 
I was gonna say fire, but no. It's going type dark, class mage, faction empire. Got a cool little crystal at the top of his staff. Dual wielding, so to speak. You want to get involved? Of course I do. So, awesome news. Immutable X stepping up with Open Sea gives us the confidence. And all these new characters coming out looks really cool. We got more information coming probably in the next couple weeks. I want to thank everybody for tuning in. Don't forget to get outside, get some exercise, some fresh air. I'm done. I'll see you guys now. Uh, see you guys later. Take care. Bye bye now. Oh, <laughs>